an honor to be here. And again, my name is Paul. Uh, um, this brief practice is designed for those who may be at work and, and need us to find a, a broom closet to <laughs> retreat from the daily uh, activities and having worked in a very deadline oriented type of work many years ago. Uh, and I had those tastes of meditation and some stretches and then honestly, I think just got me through the day <laughs> and helped me to be sane and, and internally grateful. So let's, what we're going to start with um, is take one hand to the heart and take the other hand to the heart as well. Often when we're feeling anxious, uh, any kind of dis-ease within, that's, the mind gets busy, of course, but the heart, it's really the heart that helps us to settle in and to get centered and make sure you're sitting upright, nice and tall. If you're on a chair, you might be in an office, you just sit away from the back of the chair and imagine there's an invisible crown, of, actually a visible thread lifting the crown. Close the eyelids for a moment and just gently offer the gaze forward and then slightly lift it a bit towards, you can imagine a very serene, beautiful mountain peak. And beyond the mountain peak, like a silvery white, calming, blissful light. So that whatever is going on in your day, you can give yourself permission in that little private space, even a few minutes, to put aside the mental to-do lists. Offer the awareness of the heart like a flower, like lifting its petals towards the forehead, the prefrontal lobe regions where the parts of our mind, the brain that can handle stress, they calm, cool, joyful, under pressure. If you feel to, Yogananda and Swami Kriyananda gave many beautiful affirmations to lift our subconscious and conscious minds to the divine higher conscious realm. As Shanti was talking about her beautiful talk, you can offer any time that awareness. And if you feel to mentally affirm, this is something you can do at work. Free in my heart, I live without fear. Free in my heart, I live without fear. Fear. Try to listen not just with your ears, but with your heart, your whole being. Free in my heart, I live without fear. Take a pause, feel the breath through the tips of your nostrils, filling the belly. Inhale. Exhale, letting the belly recede like the ocean tide. Now you can relax the hands and we'll open the eyelids. And let's come standing. We've been sitting for a bit. And it's also good to stretch the body. And, and yoga postures, and we're not going to be doing a lot of postures, but stretches that you might be in your work, probably the work clothes or scrubs or whatever. And it's important just to, no matter what, to get the weight, weight in that energy. So take one hand to the belly and one to the heart. This also can be done, by the way, seated, if you prefer to do that. Now, through the nostrils, inhale, fill the belly with fresh energy, fresh air. Exhale. Let the belly recede back like the ocean surf receding into the sea. Inhale, fill the belly 
Now expand, let the breath travel into the rib cage, and exhale out the heart, the ribs, the belly. Let's do this again. Inhale, breathe in the belly, the ribs. Now like a fountain of light, let the energy flow into the heart. And exhale out the heart, the ribs, the belly. Now keep going, keep the eyelids, close the eyelids if you haven't already, and just feel the rise of the inhale. And I invite you to feel that you're breathing in faith. You're breathing in joy, calmness. When you exhale, you're releasing any anxiety or worries or anything that is Standing in the way, you're feeling one, your deeper, higher, intuitive self. So just a little more here. This is called the full yogic breath. Okay, so just relax the hands down. And now we're just going to play with energy. You know, when we're working, sometimes things get a little serious and adult. And it's good to keep a joyful, lighter, energy of our being so you can have your your feet either about hip width or a little bit closer and or, and then just take the arms up inhale and stretch on the toes if you wish and then take the left arm down and then inhale stretch up and smooth nice and smooth movement inhale and the breath Exhale, consciously shifting the pace of the day within and at least your awareness of it. Good. Okay, so next time I'm going to back up. I'll project my voice a little bit. Come on the toes. If you feel to look your thumbs. Inhale. Now exhale. Let the heels relax down and start to stretch up and over. Upper body, front ribs soften in, relax the shoulders. If for any reason this is feeling a little bit too much, and you can always bend the elbows, or you can even come at the prayer of mudra, or you can also take the left hand to the ribs and just stretch the right arm over. Now close the eyelids again if you feel too. Gazing at the spiritual eye and firm. Strength and courage. Fill my body cells. Strength and courage. Fill my body cells. Soften. Gaze at the eye of the eye. We call it the spiritual eye or the eye of infinity. Forehead, take the arms up. Now, if you feel to double breathe, tense, fist, ah, some energy, exhale through the mouth, and relax the shoulders. Inhale, lift the shoulders, and roll the shoulders away from the ear. Take a pause, close the eyelids, feel the life force, the prana, energy. Flowing through. Let's do the other side. So let's take the arms up. Again, you can feel like you're lifting with a childlike sense of joy. Slowly take the right arm down. You jump up. Inhale. Then on the left side. It's okay. Smiling is also allowed, not required. <laughs> and then you can hook your thumbs if it's available or less familiar way and just feel that crescent moon shape in the body. Breathe, inhale in the stretch like a fountain, lifting the energy up. Exhale, let the breath float down. Firm mentally, strength and courage. Fills my body cells, strength and courage. Fills my body cells. Down, come up. If you can, come on the tippy toes. Inhale. 
We'll breathe tense twice through the nostrils and exhale through the mouth. Release any unnecessary tension out. Lift the shoulders, inhale. Feel to roll like waves, the shoulders back, releasing any sense of any tension or limitation in your chest, your heart. Strength and courage. Fill my body cell, dig deeper within and spiritual eye, closing the eyelids. Strength and courage, fill my body cell. Pause. Notice any sh subtle shift in the energy. Do one more simple thing you can do at, at the office that can help to release the gunk out of the heart and the body, more for the upper body, called circle of joy. So take the palms at namaste at the heart. Inhale, focusing in the heart chakra today in a brief practice. Exhale, take your palms forward, interlace the fingers. Inhale, lift the hands up, palms up, like you're breathing in joy, you're breathing in love. So inhale, and then exhale, open the arms. Now come back, interlace, interlace the fingers, squeeze the shoulder blades towards each other. Exhale, prayer mudra. Let's do this one more time. Go through it. Inhale. Exhale. Interlace the palm fingers, palms forward. Inhale. Stretch the fingers, palms up. Exhale. Open your heart. Now pause. Open in the dorsal region. Slight backward bend here. It helps facilitate courage, energy in the heart. Interlace the fingers behind. Open the chest and exhale. Namaste mudra. Now close the eyelids. Take a pause. Visualize light shining, lifting a grace of light, joy from the heart towards the forehead. Come back seated. Sit upright. Shoulders away from the ear. Good. Take the palms in prayer mudra. Take, once again, actually, take your hands to the heart. And if you feel to this time, take one of the hands, the fingers to the forehead. Consciously with the eyelids closed, drawing that awareness inwards and upwards to the eye of infinity, the gateway towards our true divine nature, peace, calm, compassion, joy, divine love. Now just simply rest the palms, at the thighs or junction of thighs and abdomen. Um, junction, or they can be resting up. Be still for this last, taking it, you're taking that private time for yourself, this last precious minute. Communing with the higher, higher light. Divine joy. The palms in prayer, Mitra. Thank you for sharing your energy. Joy to you. <laughs>